You're kidding. For a truck. For a truck. Just 70,000. 70,000. 76? Oh, okay. <laughs> 111,000. Who's buying that? <laughs> Neither of us. All right, Pops, we're here in Washington, D.C., and we're going to go up to some unsuspecting people, and we're going to see if they know what the price of a car is today in the United States of America because the price is getting too damn high. So we're going to show them a price of, like, an F-150, and then we're going to show them the actual price after they give us a guess for what they think it is. I suspect we're going to get a lot of guesses that are well below the actual price of these vehicles. Uh, and I'm going to be the one that resuscitates them once they hit the ground? Is that what you're telling me? I think that could be the case. Okie dokie, I'm ready. Let's do it. Yes. All right, I'm here with Paul. Paul, I'm going to show you. It's a 2024 Ford F-150 Tremor four-wheel four drive. What do you think? Is that tricked out? Oh, it's not tricked out. Mm, not tricked out, about 52,000. We've got a guess of 52,000. You ready, Paul? Sure. No kidding. That is astonishing. Isn't that, isn't that crazy? That's crazy. Do you want to say it for the camera? That is crazy. Yeah, we like Paul. Thank you, Paul. You isn't that nuts? I pay cash for my cars and I, you know, I, I, I drive until they wear out. You're a smart man. Ford, I love Fords, but that's ridiculous. All right, we've got a 2024 Jeep Gladiator right here. What do you think that car's worth? Uh, in America? Yeah. I would say 70 grand. 70 grand? Price is right, man. Oh, really? <laughs> Damn! Look at a price. You think? That, do you think that's a fair price, or do you think that's like a, a good price? Honestly, I think that's a really expensive. Those car break all the time. <laughs> no Jeep for me. Do you have a car? I do. I have a Subaru. All right. Do you mind sharing, like, roughly what do you make and what's your car payment? Uh, I live in Canada. Got a used, no brand new car there, and uh, I, you need it all wheel drive for the winter. So yeah. Love it. Love it. Steven, we've got ourselves here a Jeep Wrangler, 2024 Jeep Wrangler. I want you to give me a guess. What do you think this car is worth right now? 24, um, 27,000. 27,000? How you doing? Shoot. That's <laughs> crazy. That's not just inflation. <laughs> That's not just inflation. Do you own a car? Uh, yeah, I do. Do you mind like roughly like what do you make and what's your car payment? Um, well, I don't like have it running yet. It's a, it's a project car, so. Nice. All right. That's always the best. All right, Stephen, we got another one for you. This is a souped up full-size pickup truck from Ram. Okay, it's the TRX. This is like their nicest one. All right, the most expensive one. What do you think the nicest, most expensive Ram TRX costs? It's anything like that, I'd say like 80. That's a good guess, folks. 80? You're kidding. For a truck. <laughs> for a truck. Oh my gosh. That's... Isn't that nuts? Yeah, I can't believe it. Who, who can afford that? Uh, not me. <laughs> not me either, man. All right, we're here with NIE. Yes. All right, NIE, my name is Zach. I'm going to show you a 2024 Toyota Tundra, and I want you to guess what you think the price of it is, okay? Okay. Mm. 7000 with 800 $7,800. Drum roll, please. Just 70,000. 70, all right. Isn't that crazy? Yeah, it's so much. All right, I'm here with Ryan. Ryan, I'm going to show you a Range Rover. You look like a guy who would like a 2024 Range Rover SV. All right. What do you think this costs? Let's let's say 85. 85? You ready? <laughs> yeah, a little more than I thought. Jesus. Ryan, do you own a car? Uh, I do not. I do. Smart. That's a smart man. Yeah, I just took the metro here. I want you to guess, what do you think the price of this truck is? 80000 Chris, we're going to have to do another one, man. Damn. <laughs> yeah, well, it just looks like it's worth 80000 So I'm going to give you a used Tesla, okay? 2017 Tesla Model S. All right. It's got 35,000 miles on it. What do you think? 35000 Pretty doggone close. 45000 We love it. Okay, well, yeah, I guess I'm good at this. Chris, do you own a car? Uh, yeah. Do you mind sharing what your car payment is? Uh, I lease it, so and my company pays for it, so I don't actually know. We like Chris. Thanks so much. <laughs> All right, uh, I'm here with Taylor. Taylor, I'm Zach. I'm going to show you this 2024 Ram 1500. It's a limited trim. All right, man, okay, I want you to limited. guess. What do you think this thing costs right now? Brand new Ram 1500. 39K. 39K. You feel good about that answer? Yeah, I feel all right. I'm You're locking it in? Locking it in. 76? Holy moly. Dude, it's expensive, right? It's expensive. You, yeah, and I drive a truck. That's funny. You want to do one more? Yeah, let's do one more. All right, Taylor, we're back for round two. All right, round two. Double or nothing. Double or nothing. 2024 Ford F 150, the Tremor. All right, that's a nice one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All, All right. right. What do you think this thing costs? It's a little better this time. I'm going to go 91. 91. 91. All right. 
80. Oh, Lord. This, this is closer, expensive closer, stuff. Closer, closer. All right, you drive a truck? Yeah, I drive a truck. Tell us a little bit about what do you drive, what's your, and do you mind sharing, what's your payment? 2024 Ford Maverick, and my payment is like 580 a month. That's below the average, man. Yeah. And the Maverick's sweet. The Maverick is nice, but I have an XLT. I don't have the Lariat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, thanks, Taylor. Appreciate it, man. Congrats on the yeah. Maverick, man. Those, yeah, are, those are hard to get your hands on. Yeah, dude, I was trying to get one for in 2023. They were completely gone. There was just not. Um, I had to wait a whole year to get one. Are you surprised by how expensive these trucks are? The Maverick, no. But the other ones, yes. The other two, absolutely. For sure, for sure. <laughs> All right, Tracy, my name's Zach. I'm going to show you here. We've got a 2024 Jeep Gladiator Rubicon four-wheel drive. Any guesses? What do you think it costs? Mm. I wouldn't even know. I mean, I don't six something maybe six six thousand or more like i'm not sure i don't you ready purchase cars how much is it 69 okay i was in the right <laughs> area i was in the right area with the 60s yeah <laughs> thank you tracy wow isn't that expensive too much that's why i walk <laughs> We've got a 2024 Toyota Tundra, uh, 1794 edition. We know you love that, right? Yeah, now. What do you think this thing costs, man? I'd say around 60 to 70. Damn. 70. Oh, okay. Does that feel, does that feel expensive to you? I mean, to me, it's all yeah, it's expensive. <laughs> do you have a car to run? No, not at the moment. Smart man. All right, we've got a 2024 Jeep Grand Wagoneer Series 2 four-wheel drive. Any guesses for a brand new Jeep? Hmm. Uh-huh. I'm thinking up. I like how I like how you think, man. What are you thinking? Uh, I'm gonna go 80. Oh, okay. <laughs> hey. 111,000, man. 111,000. Who's buying that? <laughs> Neither of us. I'm gonna show you this 2024 Jeep Gladiator Rubicon X four-wheel drive. Your favorite. Right. What do you think that that costs? Uh, something like 40,000. 40,000. It's 69. All right. Oops. <laughs> Do you have a car, Leon? No, I don't. Smart man. Also, I'm not from the U.S., so I don't know really. Does that like, does that seem like a good price, even though you're not from the U.S.? Like 70 grand for a car? Yeah, I guess. I, guess. I want to be more like Leon when I grow up. Damn, that's a lot of money to me. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, this is an American staple, Leon. This is the 2024 Jeep Grand Wagoneer. All right. That looks premium, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. It's like a hundred thousand. No. Oh. Uh, I don't know what you do for a career, man, but this could be it. <laughs> All right. Well, that looks good. <laughs> Thanks, man. Appreciate Thanks. it. Leon, Leon, not from the United States, knows his stuff. I'm impressed. Car Edge Concierge, the revolutionary way to buy your next car. You tell us what you want, and our team of experienced concierges goes to work on your behalf. They source the vehicle, negotiate the price, and make arrangements to have it delivered to you directly. Never set foot in a car dealership again. CarEdge.com slash concierge to learn more about how you have the power to save both your time and money. Let the car buying revolution begin at CarEdge.